Welcome to Deer Camp Harvest Report. Thanks for joining me. In this episode, as we do in every episode, we will take a look at a few impressive animals that have been harvested recently. Let's start off by taking a look at this Missouri buck that's being talked a lot about. A buck the hunter fittingly nicknamed Wide Load. He is wide indeed. I wonder just how wide. The buck scores 185 inches, but the way the pictures were taken, it looks even bigger than that. Even Josh Bomar would be proud of these camera angles. When I first seen the picture of this buck, I immediately thought of the Rompola buck, except this one is real. I myself, like many others, would like to see a normal picture of this buck just to get a real idea of just how big or rather not big this buck really is. Nonetheless, still a magnificent animal. I believe the hunt for this deer will be on the Stay Grounded YouTube channel, so we can look forward to that. Next up, we will head down to Georgia to yet again catch up with the guys over at Seek One. As I've said in a previous episode, we would be seeing Lee sitting behind another giant whitetail yet this season. I do enjoy being right. As Lee does with most of the deer he harvests, he has a long storied history with this buck. Sounds like he's been watching this deer for the last four years. That's a lot of hunting seasons for a deer to survive through to get this big. Uh, the buck scores 182 inches. Quite impressive indeed. I always enjoy seeing pictures with hunters sharing the story with their hunting buddies. That's what a good deer camp is really about. Congratulations, Lee. I will yet again say that I know we will be seeing you behind another giant buck this year, and I look forward to that. Staying in Georgia, let's take a look at this very impressive buck taken by a hunter named Matt Vizdzak. He ended his four-year chase of this buck with an arrow out of his Matthews. The buck scores 191 inches. A behemoth, no doubt. I love the coloration in this buck's antlers. These Georgia giants really make a guy think hard about heading south for a hunt. Congratulations, Matt, on an awesome buck. Lastly, let's check out this hunter's very first deer harvest ever. Michaela Gandy punched her first deer tag in Ohio on this gorgeous buck nicknamed Extra. I assume, because of the extra point coming out of its head, perhaps that could even be an extra beam. Either way, it's extra special for a first-ever deer. This one will be hard to beat Michaela, but I'd say you're off to a great start in hunting. That'll do it for this episode of Deer Camp Harvest Report. Until next time, remember, you're always welcome at Deer Camp.